The infection rate in Bolton is now higher than it's been anywhere else. It's lockdown currently the toughest in the country. And yet even here, getting a test requires perseverance. After two days trying, it ran out for the Asiki family. So in desperation, they just turned up and were turned away. Their son has asthma. An A&E doctor advised he get tested. What do we do? Because you can't get online appointments, you can't do anything. He's so I'm worried. You see the politicians talking about how many loads of tests that have been prompting what they're doing and all that. And you get when it gets down to business, it's rubbish. There are big signs here urging people if they've got symptoms, get a test. And yet even with a Bolton postcode, if I check availability now, I'm told there are no test sites available, either drive-in or walk-in, and no home kits either. Yesterday uh, I got offered a test, I think it was North Wales, I didn't recognise where it was from. Um, a friend of mine got offered one in Northern Ireland. Uh, and then this morning I got offered one in Telford, uh, which is 60 miles away from, from my house. Um, and then I just happened to be lucky, refreshed and quickly got one here. But many people who are fed up trying are now turning up at hospitals. Yesterday we had around about 100 people waiting in A&E for a variety of reasons, but a large percentage of them were were people who were unable to get a test either for themselves or for their family. And obviously this created huge pressure. We had ambulances queuing up outside um, and also you've got potentially the danger of, of infections. Local officials say they'll only be able to bring Bolton's outbreak under control if testing is effective. In our view, it's improved, but it's far from being good enough. Rates are increasing and guess what? Everyone's asking for tests but obviously Bolton is, is at the top of that list and therefore we would want it to be prioritised. There are already four test sites here and more capacity is being added. They were busy and largely orderly today, but in Britain's worst hit town, demand is still outstripping supply of these vital tests. Ben Chapman, ITV News, Bolton.